I started asking her a little bit about Wrigley and how old he was and stuff. And then, um, you know, and it was a service dog. And then she said that she was a Marine. And I was like, oh, well, me too. <laughs> so uh, I did 17 years in the Marine Corps. Once a Marine, always a Marine is not something we just say. Uh, it's, you know, it's who we are. A gas station clerk owner had seen the news and then realized that Wrigley was in his store about eight hours prior. When you see the gas station security footage, he's kind of, Wrigley's kind of sitting outside, just hanging out. I speculate that's probably kind of where the guy dropped him off at after he stole the truck. But the dog just kind of sat there. He kind of hung out like, all right, you're coming back to get me, right? Somebody hold the door for him. He walked around inside the store. See, no, they found him. Community had really pulled together. I mean, I was floored. I mean, 24 hours we found this dog. We found a dog in a metropolitan city in a county. I mean, of I don't know, know what our population is—a few million. You know, what I mean, we find a dog. That's huge. We got a happy ending for this. You know, so that was awesome. <laughs>